Hey, my name is Erin and I'm a former US Junior Olympic certified swim coach and personal trainer and fitness is my passion, so I cannot wait to share it with you guys. All right, diet and nutrition tips for women. Your workout really isn't gonna make a difference if your diet is not clean. So you're putting in all this time and effort at the gym or at home or in the pool or wherever it may be doing our videos, um, and that's all great, but you're not gonna see the results if your diet is not clean. You need to keep a healthy, rested, hydrated body free of garbage and chemicals as much as possible. You don't have to be perfect, but just try and make small changes because small changes over time do add up. The first thing that I always stress is water. Water, water everywhere. Seriously, you need to drink at least half of your body weight in ounces of water each day. Another component of clean eating is making sure that your food is literally clean. We're fortunate that in this day and age, organic health food stores are springing up all over the place and that, that sort of um, access to that is, is easier than it has been in the past. If organic is um, not available to you or it's too expensive, that's fine. Just try and go for hormone and antibiotic free because what you don't want is you don't want to be consuming tons of protein to try and build this muscle mass at the same time consuming antibiotics and growth hormones and all sorts of other garbage that um, unfortunately is in a lot of lower quality uh, meat. You really just want to stay as close to nature as possible. That's the key to clean eating. And then, you know, last but not least, it's really important to enjoy yourself. So you should enjoy your food, you should pay attention to what you're eating, how you're eating it, when you're eating it, and how you feel when you're consuming your food. Because at the end of the day, consuming food should be pleasurable, but it should also, it should also be nourishing. And so the best way to know if something is good for you or not is just listening to your body. How many times do we eat, I don't know, a large burrito from a fast food chain, let's say, and two hours later you're like, oh my God, I can't believe I just did that. That. Part of it is because you just don't feel good. You feel slow, weighed down, or gassy, or whatever it may be. It's fine to indulge, but just indulge wisely. Do it in moderation. Don't do it all the time. Don't freak out if you fall off. That's the worst thing you can do. You know, a donut is not going to kill you. It's really, really pretty simple and straightforward. Most important is, is you know, keep it clean, drink tons of water, and listen to your body.